Hi my dear friends, today topic is SAP SD Enterprise Structure Overview. First of all, let us see the map or let us see this structure. This is SAP SD Enterprise Structure. You just understand here this company and company code. This company and company code. This company and company code belongs to SAP FI Enterprise Structure. SAP FI Enterprise Structure. But this is the FI Enterprise Structure. Why you are, I mean, captured here? It means in the company code, this company code may assign n number of sales organization a number of sales organization first of all you need to understand what is meant by company and what is meant by company code then entire enterprise structure we need to understand what is meant by company let us see here ms word i prepared this notes for your understanding purpose company is the highest organization of fi enterprise structure keep it on your mind company is the highest organization of fi enterprise structure this company under the see under this company n number of company codes may assign okay you just keep it on your mind n number of company codes okay n number of company codes may assign one company okay then see this one company is the highest hierarchy then what is meant by company code company code is a legal entity based on the financial statements we can prepare company code let us understand let us understand one of my company one of my company is preparing the three sets of financial statements it means i need to create three company codes okay and one of another company let us uh, understand that for example the company name is called x y sorry x y z limited x y z limited they create two sets of financial statements two sets of financial statement it means this xyz company they want to prepare two company codes two company codes so what need to understand this company code is the legal entity company code is the legal entity based on the financial statements we need to create company codes okay even uh, this what is meant by company and what is meant by company code even in this my channel i prepared fi enterprise structure uh, you watch that video you can easily understand more information okay even uh, that link i will give you in the description box you can watch fi enterprise structure for your understanding purpose yeah now see this one sap organization is sorry sales organization this entire structure is sap organization but you need to understand sales organization concentrate here this company is the highest hierarchy of the fi enterprise structure this sales organization is the highest hierarchy of the sd organizational structure okay you just keep it on your mind this is very very important important interview question what is meant by sales organization sales organization is the highest hierarchy of the sd enterprise structure here the decisions make and here this is nothing but corporate office okay in this corporate office the ceo managing directors directors all are sitting one place they can make the decisions they can make the decision they are not executing the decision they are making the decisions okay how to execute the decision i will tell you later okay sales organization is the nothing but corporate office 
all the higher authorities sitting into the corporate office they are making the decisions okay let us see the word for your understanding purpose i make some word see this one the sales organizations you just see this point the sales organization is an organizational unit within the logistic that structure that company according to the sales requirement so i said in this sales organization they will take the decision which type of decision they will take they will take sales requirement decisions sales requirement decision let it let us assume let us assume i want to take loan you just concentrate here i want to take one loan see HDFC bank given 6% of interest and uh, ICICA bank given 5% of interest. So I am end user. Okay, I need to take the loan. So which bank I preferred? I preferred like ICICA bank. So this interest part, who will take the decision? Sales organizational level. Sales organization. See, once again, I will tell you, I mean, open Excel. Do one thing. I am the end user concentrate here I am the end user I need loan what I need I need loan you just see here this is HDFC bank this is ICICI bank in the I need loan either I want to go HDFC bank or either I want to go ICIC bank HDFC bank is a 5% of interest rate or 6% of interest rate whatever and ICIC bank 5% of interest rate so obviously the end user and need to go um, obviously need to go ICIC bank so this interest part this interest part who will take the decision the sales organizational level take the decision okay okay then do one thing i will give you one more example i will give you one more example like uh, yeah like any not only uh, any for, see this one see understand this point sales requirements decisions lot of competitors is there i want to buy one car I want to buy one car like uh, I need to first I can see the futures and later I can see the price so futures price all the sales requirements decisions made in the sales organization okay and uh, see this one uh, see for example see this one example I given one example here example regional regional subdivision of the market can also be carried out with the help of sales organization each business transaction see this one last point each business transaction is proceed within the sales organization this is very very important each business transaction is proceed within a sales organization okay and uh, in the in the interview they will ask how many sales organization you need to create n number of sales organization you you can create okay it may be multiple sales organization we need to create but as per sap suggest maybe you can create three or four okay see this graph see this graph multiple sales organizations you can assign to one company code okay multiple sales organization you can create to one sales organization sorry multiple sales organization you can assign to one company code in this company code level they can create financial statements this finance this company code you can assign to company okay then yeah and the next one is distribution channel distribution channel 
this is very important concentrate here distribution channel yeah one second the next one is distribution channel so what is meant by distribution channel you just understand here see this one you just see this point I added one point here you can cap you just understand this point yeah distribution channel is the way of selling the goods and service to the customer the distribution channel is the way of selling goods and goods and service to the customer you just see this point also is a very important one it is a way of distributions of goods to the end user to the end user concentrate here you just understand here and see i am the end user i am the end user i need to buy one car i need to buy one car so when i want to buy any car i don't want to go directly i don't want to go directly plant okay i can buy a car in the retailer okay for example i want to buy one mobile i want to buy one mobile what can i do directly i need to go plant no i want to go retail retailer store retailer store i want to go see this one first this mobile this mobile manufactured into the plant this is the distribution cycle distribution cycle understand here this example this mobile manufactured into the plant and this all the mobiles sent to the dealer sent to the dealers and this dealer sent to the distributor this distributor may wholesaler wholesaler sent to the retailer this retailer sell to the end user okay this is the channel of distributing the products and services the manufacturer companies they don't want to sell any product directly to the end user every company they have one distribution channel example this is the standards standard channel the manufacturing companies make the products in the plant they can send to the dealer dealer again they can have some uh, like uh, commission and all they can send to the distributor and distributor sent to the wholesaler wholesaler sent to the retailer from the retailer end user will buy the products any products it may be mobile services uh, cars anyone this distribution channel see see here i here i can make an one notes here yeah yeah you just uh, see again once again this point and uh, yeah i'm to here up to here see this one distribution channel is the way of selling goods and service to the customer it is a way of distributions of goods to the end user okay sales organization can have no distribution channel okay see this one the sales organization they don't want to directly send to the material the material will dispatch through distribution channel in the sales organizational they will take the decisions they are not sending to any product to the end user who will say i mean who will uh, how to send the products through distribution channel okay and do one thing you just observe the next point this is one of the interview question what is meant by sales line what is meant by sales line sales line nothing but combination of sales organization and distribution channel see this one this sales organizational and distribution channel this otherwise take this two okay this two hmm. yeah 
series one sales organization and distribution channel is called sales line sales organizational and distributional channel is called sales line what happened here the sales organization take the decision and distribution channel is executing the products this is the way what is the way this is the way this entire structure is called distribution channel this entire structure is called distribution channel and plant dealers distributors and wholesaler retailer end user so we are the end user we need to uh, i mean buy the goods and services and blah blah x y z okay so this sales organizational and distribution channel is called sales line it's called sales line and uh, see this one sales organizational and distribution channel the next is division next is division what is mean by division yeah what is mean by division see this one i can even i entered here what is mean by division see this one this is a very very important division division used to group goods and services certain nature of the share come common trend see this one you just understand here um, what is meant by division means division is the group of products division is the group of products let it be uh, go to excel for your understanding purpose i will explain one thing here i am the electronic manufacturer company i am the electronic manufacturer manufacturer company example i am the electronic manufacturer company see this one uh, yeah one second i have two lens here i'm i have one is mobile and uh, one is laptops one is mobiles and one is laptops see this one i am the electronic manufacturer company here one is mobile sector and one is laptop sector under this mobile sector they have different different uh, uh, like uh, models like uh, i20 example i20 and uh, any models i40 and uh, i60 i60 mobile model example in the laptops is let us take the laptops model uh, 4.0 and uh, 4.0 version and uh, let it be let us 4.0 model example 4.0 model and uh, 4. Point 5.0 model and uh, see this is the models and this is also models so what is mean by this one what is mean by division division nothing but group of products division nothing but group of products let us understand i have one electronic company here two segments is there one is mobile segments and laptop segments under this mobile different different group of products under laptop different different products see here division nothing but division is used to group goods and services okay group goods and services example this is one division and this is another division division nothing but group of goods or services goods nothing but products okay and uh, so this is the division this is the division and uh, see this one what is meant by sales area this is the one of the interview question what is meant by sales area okay sales area nothing but see here sales area is combination of sales organization distribution channel and division 
these three elements see here what is meant by sales area sales area is combination of sales organization distribution channel and division okay see here uh, yeah sales area nothing but sales organizational distribution channel and division here i we can enter sales area okay and uh, this is also one of the interview question actually even here i can add one note combination of sales organization distribution channel and division is called sales area okay and uh, so sales area is completed next sales office see this one uh, sales office here i can added one point here see here mm, yeah yes see this one for your understanding purpose sales office are often located in different areas for example i have one sales office in hyderabad i have one sales office in bangalore and i have one sales office in new jersey sales office nothing but it's a geographical area for example see this one understand here and yeah this sales organizational taking the decisions this sales office is execute the decision okay are you understand this uh, point yeah in the sales sales organizational they are making the decisions sales office is execute the decisions execute the decisions okay and uh, this is the sales group and sales group is nothing but uh, within the office we have different different uh, like uh, departments one department they are selling to the uh, and one department they are selling take the i mean selling to the mobiles and one department they are selling to the laptops like different different and uh, authentications here okay and uh, see uh, you just understand here this company code okay yeah this company code under this company code different different company codes yeah concentrate once again under this company under this company we have company codes under this company code we have sales organization under this sales organization we have distribution channels and divisions okay this organizational distribution channel division is called sales area under this sales area we have sales office under this sales office we have sales group okay and within the sales office we have sales group so this is the sap sd organizational overview or enterprise structure overview the next video will coming to the configuration in sap how to configure sap sd enterprise structure next video will come so thanks for watching if you like this video please subscribe share and comment okay in case of any comment you just dropped in the comment box uh, i will revert you thank you thank you very much